If you're a racing fan, you need to see this. A rookie's first shot at Formula One glory. Mike stands beside his gleaming Midland Formula One car. Adrenaline and nerves swirling inside him. The grandstands are a sea of cheering fans and Union Jack flags, he remembers. His father teaching him the art of racing on local karting tracks, it was never just about winning, but a shared passion and relentless pursuit of a dream. Now, with recent triumphs in test drives and time trials behind him, Mike grips the steering wheel, his team principal Jenny asks, are you ready? Mike nods, taking a deep breath, ready as I'll ever be. As pre-race festivities fade and the roar of engines fills the air, doubts creep in. Can this rookie prove his worth? Tune in as the lights go green and see if Mike has what it takes to become a Formula One driver. Each of the drivers waiting for the lights to signal the start of the race. The race is go, go, go! Missy Keller gets off the grid well. Button gets a poor start. Here they come, into the first turn. You're making good progress moving on the back. Here come the front runners piling into turn two. Montoya still leading. He's followed by Alonso. Next is Fisichella. Making real progress here, you're doing well. First lap completed, the field looks like this. Montoya is first, Alonso is second, Fisichella third, fourth, Michael Schumacher, Kimi Raikkonen fifth, Weber sixth. He's up from seventh, truly seventh, down six places from his qualifying position, and Button eighth. Next lap is scheduled to stop, reminder to stop, next lap. Good stuff, you just put in your best time through sector one. You're quite far back, you're running at 18. seconds through sector two. Your tires are reading green on the condition indicator. You should have optimum grip levels now. Looking good mate, you're moving very well through the field. As the drivers start their third lap, Montoya is first, Alonso is second, Fisichella third, Fourth is Trulli, Button is fifth. He's moved up from eighth. In sixth is Coulthard. That's a jump of three places. Schumacher, seventh. Heitfeld is in eighth place. Your stop is at the end of this lap. Stop at the end of this lap. Great first sector. That's the fastest time you've set so far. Time to 
Sector 2. As we head into the final few laps, Fisichella leads. Button is second. Ralf Schumacher is in third place. He's up from seventh. Villeneuve is fourth. Clean is fifth. That's a massive leap of seven places. Montoya sixth. Alonso seventh. He slid down from second. And Trulli is eighth. While your tyres are blue, don't go crazy. Wait till they're green and you have optimum traction. Second faster through sector two. According to the car condition indicator, your tires have reached a good heat and grip level should be pretty good. Here's the current top eight. Montoya is first. He's up from seven. Fisichella is second. Alonso third. That's a leap of six places. Fourth, Michael Schumacher. Kimi Raikkonen in fifth. Jensen Button in sixth, he slid down from second, Weber seventh, and Trulli is eighth. You're doing well, that's the best time you've achieved through sector one. Frontrunner Montoya has begun his final lap of the race. Fisichella is in second behind him. Well, Pablo Montoya just started his last lap. He's out in front and looks like he's going to win. Only one more lap to go, and the current race order looks like this. Montoya is first. Fisichella is second. Alonso third. He slid down from second. Fourth, Michael Schumacher. Kimi Raikkonen fifth. Incident, Sector 2. Yellow flags are out. No overtaking. Are there yellow flags out in Sector 1? No overtaking. Well done. You're moving up the field. Well done. 0.2 seconds faster through the first sector. That's it, Montoya takes first place. Fisichella will finish the race in second.
Silverstone comes up trumps again, another fantastic race. And so we conclude the final part of this first European leg. We'll be back here in mid-July to decide some of the other famous European races like Manicor in France and the second German Grand Prix venue, Hockenheim.